I purchased some more three liter sodas. But before we get into these, I've actually got some more normal size ones that we've got to get into first. And the ones that I'm talking about are these guys here. We've got all three of the Sanderson sisters from, of course, Hocus Pocus. And so that was Sarah Sanderson. And then we also have Mary Sanderson. And then the last one over here, Winifred. And I'm really hoping I can get those chases. And I do understand it's a little bit after Halloween, but I ordered them from the Funko shop and I'm here in Canada. So they take a little bit longer. And so let's crack into the first one here, which is Winifred. And fingers crossed I can get the chase and it's completely green. And actually that's the same for all three of these characters. So whatever their main color is, that's the chase. Take a look at them. Seriously, some cool ones. And now for this first one, we've got just the normal Winifred. It's definitely too bad, but I don't have any of her in my collection, so I'll take it. Oh, and you guys might have noticed that these ones here are limited to 25,000 pieces. I think the, actually now that I say that, not really limited, it's the least limited I've ever opened up. And now here's the thing, I'm not sure if they've sold out on the Funko shop yet, so I could get more technically, but do I really want to? I know. So here we go, everybody, the chase. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It is <laughs> another common Winifred. That is too bad, but hey, still a really, really detailed soda. I like the broom in her hand as well as the potion in the other. Her face just looks a little weird. I mean, her teeth are massive. <laughs> Alrighty, now let's get into Mary Sanderson, and I'm pretty sure her chase is purple, which is going to be pretty obvious that we get it. And so here we go, everybody. Let's find out. Did we get that chase? Come on. I can't see it yet. Ooh, but I'm seeing normal colored hair. And it looks like, yeah, this is just the common one, but she has some pretty great detail, very similar to Winifred. And I think they're doing a really great job with them. It's just too bad we're not getting those chases. I keep scooting over as I go. We're probably going to have to take them off the table when I do Sarah. But anyways, let's get into the second one that we've got here for Mary and Oh, I really hope it's it. And the thing is with these ones, you can't even tell by weight. And here's the thing, I don't like to check them. Plus I ordered them online, so I couldn't even check them. But because they're only a different color, they're pretty much the exact same. And this is, oh, we got it. And I guess I was wrong about it being purple. She's actually completely red. Okay, wow, that is super bright. I was thinking purple because of the can, but I guess she's completely red because of her dress. And there is the common and chase next to each other. And then if you guys want to check this out, they're calling it. You found the chase translucent red Mary Sanderson. Hey, pretty cool. It's also limited to one out of 4,100. So still pretty rare. Well, everybody, that's another perfect soda for the books. And let's get into our first Sarah for today. And it's kind of funny. I couldn't get into it. There we go. <laughs> now it's getting a little easier. And if I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys, I don't really know what the color is on this one. Maybe she's purple and that's why I got it mixed up. But then again, I don't want to say a color and it be wrong. So let's just crack her open. And now please be a translucent one. Please be a translucent one. It is, ooh, just the normal colors. Well, it's obviously not the chase, but again, a pretty nice soda. And I like that she's got the broom in one hand or more of like a, a mop kind of thing, as well as the paintbrush on her belt. That's well done. And so now everybody, we've got one more shot at this before we get into the three liter sodas for today. And I really am hoping I can get that chase. And that way in the future, if I wanted to get more, I would just have to get Winifred. I'm gonna be honest guys, I am nervous. So now let's get into this here. Come on. Oh, we got another common Sarah. It's too bad. Now, really quickly, I wanted to jump in because inside of this box, there was something else besides the sodas and I wanted to show you guys. And it's inside of this box right here. It's one of those free Funko Pops when you spend over $50 on the Funko Shop. And if you guys didn't know this was the thing, I definitely recommend checking whenever you're ordering because you can get cool figures like this and you wouldn't want to miss out on it. And of course, the one that I got this time was the Sully with Boo. But in the past, I've also got like DJ Khaled as well as Rick with the vial. It's a pretty cool figure. And so if you're already at $50, it will tell you in your cart. But if you're not at $50 and you're just under, I don't believe it will. So try to hit that $50 or at least look out for it if you ever see something like this going on. Because honestly, they are some pretty cool figures and most of the time they do Funko Shop exclusive. So if you're thinking of picking one up and you're buying some other stuff already, you might be able to get it for free. And I mean, seriously, who wouldn't want the Sully with Boo in their collection, especially with her in the takeout container? It's got some really nice detail. I'm also not exactly 
sure how many of this figure they made, but seriously, it is a really cool, and I'm surprised it hasn't sold out yet. And anyways, I thought I might as well mention it because it did come in my order with the three liter sodas. And actually, now that we're talking about them, let's go crack them open. So let's get into these ones here. And I think the first one I'm gonna start with is the Wampa, and then we'll do Maleficent after. And feeling both of these here, they're kind of similar. So I think I'm gonna be going with, let's do this one first. And now I've talked about these before on the channel, but because they're a little bit newer and they've only really made like, I think five different ones with the Hulk coming soon, and I will definitely be picking up some of him. I figure I might as well show you guys how to open these. So at the bottom here, there's like this big piece of plastic that you take off and then you actually pop the whole bottom of the soda off. And it's something like this, where you like push and then pull, and then you push and pull on like three or four of the tabs, and then it should just pop off like that. And so let me see if I can find the front. Okay, there it is right there. And let me pull this thing off in three, two, one. By the way, the chase is him with no arm. So here we go, you guys ready? Three, two, one. He's got both arms. Well, everybody, it looks like we got another common Wampa. This is definitely not my first time opening them up. I just wanted to get more to see if I could get those chases because for one this size, I have never had one. And so it's too bad on the first one, but the Wampa still really does look amazing. And I'm not opposed to having another one. It's just who needs five of these guys? Or well, actually at the moment, four. So fingers crossed this one is the chase. So we have four commons, one chase. That would be nice. Okay, everybody, here we go. Let's get into this one and fingers crossed it is the chase and if I'm gonna be honest with you guys it does feel a little bit lighter but I don't know alrighty what do I do let me see there is the front and here we go everybody you ready three two one oh no well so far not so good on the wampa sodas we got another common so this is now the sixth one i've opened should i just go online and buy the chase maybe am i going to no probably not well wampa i apologize but back in the can you go and no don't worry because we still have maleficent for today and this is one that i've only ever opened up two of and i gotta say one does feel a little bit heavier so let's start with this one because if you guys don't know we're actually going for the opposite where with the wampa you want the lighter bottles but then for this one here you actually want the heavier one and to be honest with you i don't actually know how much heavier they would be but i still think that there is a bit of a weight difference because for the chase one they actually have the fire in front of her and so here we go let's pop this off and find out if we got the chase or the common on the first one okay uh that is the front and here we go not seeing any fire which is definitely too bad but this one here is still one of my favorite three liter sodas they've made so far and if you guys want to take a look at her out of the can well out of the bottle i guess you could say here she is so definitely still a nice one and it's only my third one like this not my sixth so it's not as bad so now everybody here we go we are getting into our last one for the day i mean fingers crossed we get the chase because I, here's the thing i got one chase today which isn't too bad but another one would be nice especially because you do spend 40 dollars on these guys so anyways let me show you guys the front and here we go come on oh geez okay so as you guys can tell we did not get the chase and i really did want to get this one because she's got the fire in front of her as well as glitter covering the entire figure it would have been really cool and i mean hey what can i do at this point i've opened them all up and they aren't the chases well i guess i could order some more if they're still in stock i'll see you guys tomorrow